Amelie. Amelie. You getting the house ready, girl? You cleaning? Good morning, everybody. How you doing? I, I am tired. Today is Yoko's birthday. I'm really excited. I would be more excited if I haven't been up since 4 a.m. with Amelie, but it's still gonna be a great day. <laughs> I guess the good thing about Amelie waking up so early today is that I've been able to mentally prepare for the morning that I would like Yuka to have. We have a really cool day planned. I'm really excited. I'm just waiting for Sofia to wake up. She's sleeping right now with Yuka, and we will bring him some coffee and start start the celebration. <laughs> Dada, yeah, it's Dada's birthday. Yeah, you like flowers? Mm-mm. Mm-mm. The girls are now making um, Yuka some birthday cards. And I love these handmade birthday cards. They're the best. Right, this is little Ampu's birthday card. Wow. Ihana. <laughs> Picture. This is one of Yuka's birthday gifts because he's always looking for these things, so we finally got him some. And then Ampu will bring him a flower. Let me get them. Let me get the band ready. Yeah. Okay, you ready? Yeah. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear EC. Happy birthday to you. <laughs> I think the morning's been a success so far. We just got the whole circus back in town, so I'm gonna go ahead and make some breakfast. I'm gonna just make, like, you know, a nice little, like, spread. I think I'm gonna make some chocolate chip banana pancakes, um, some scrambled eggs, some avocado, something. I don't know, fresh fruit, the works, everything. Birthday boy, happy birthday to you. Yeah, yeah, thank you. We had a lovely family lunch. Now we're gonna go pick up Yugi's birthday cake. Ooh. The kids have come up with this very special design. I'm very excited to see the outcome. It's gonna be super cool. Yeah? 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 <laughs> Yuga just went with the older kids to take the boys to the dog park, so now I'm gonna set up his little home party. Just wrapped his gifts, uh, me and the kids Got some cool gifts for him, and uh, we went to the party store. And apparently, and apparently, and apparently, we're gonna be having a Darth Vader themed party. Sisu picked out some Darth Vader plates, some napkins, some masks, <laughs> and then Sophia picked out party hats. <laughs> the babies are in a nap, so I'm gonna um, set up the table and all that good stuff. Oh my god, I've got the cake, it's so cool. It's in the fridge right now, so I'll show you guys when the party happens, but. When he comes home, we're gonna have a little family birthday. I just love birthdays so much. I ended up making a janky little birthday sign, but I love, I love these. <laughs> these make me so happy. Hello. Oh, I see my cake. No, not yet. Thank you. You really love you guys. I have the best life and best family. I'm very happy where I am. What up? Is dressed up nicely. Sisu. 
Ampo, Lily, Oy, Nino, Cheese. <laughs> little, give us a little strut. Wow. Give us a little outfit twirl. She got a little, little bit of this and a little bit of that and a little bit of this and a little bit of that. You're so cool. You're All so right, cool. let's go. I love you, baby. Mm. Mm. We wanted to uh, have a fine dining experience with the kids, so we're taking the whole circus to, uh, to a nice restaurant. I think it's gonna go great. Baby, I love you. Thank you for the best birthday. You deserve it. Family matters. Yes. Wow, look at that tat. Wow, what, 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 what? We went to this restaurant called Ragu that's in Helsinki, little booty dance. <laughs> Ampu being cute and Yuka being Yuka. <laughs> Now Sophia is practicing some fine dining etiquette, classy lady. We all were a fan of the bread, especially Ampu. First up, we had this beef tartar sheet, so tasty, yum. And Ampu had this pea risotto with some codfish. It was delish. <laughs> she was a fan. The kids also ordered some mocktails, which I thought was really cute. Then we had this mushroom soup with this like fried jalapeno in the middle. Oh my gosh, that was so good. Then we got the alcoholic versions of the kids' mocktails because they were that good. Overall, it was a really vibey place. I really liked it. Ampu had to burn off some steam, so she was just running around in this one section for a while. Then our main was the same pea risotto codfish. <laughs> Ampu, did you have a good celebration? <laughs> Like you've been through a lot. <laughs> I did. So did you. I'm gonna try to do this outro to the best of my abilities. <laughs> I'm currently a little bit sick, so bear with me. I didn't end up getting a chance to record um, the rest of the dinner because, as you can imagine, the kids, specifically the little ones, got a bit restless. Our focus was really on taming them <laughs> but dessert was fire the kids i took one bite and then the kids ended up stealing it i believe and i'm sorry this was like a few weeks ago so it's hard to remember um it was some kind of like blueberry gelato something i don't know it was delicious this year for yuka's birthday we really wanted to just have a family birthday yuka is um someone who constantly puts his family's needs over his own because that's just who he is at heart we really wanted his birthday to be all about him and what makes him the happiest and that's his family plus it's cool to like get kids all dressed up and go eat somewhere nice i feel like most people wouldn't take <laughs> Four children under 10 years old to <laughs> fine dining, but you never know unless you try. <laughs> it was quite the experience. I wanna say a quick few things about Yuka if I can. From the moment that I met Yuka, I was always drawn towards his inner light. I knew that when I met him that I would have him in my life forever. I just never knew that I'd be so lucky enough to have him as my husband and as the father of my children. He's an inspiration to so many, including myself, um, as a parent, as a hard worker, and as somebody who always sees the brighter side of life. He's idolized by our children and for a good reason. He guides our family with love and courage. And he's also the biggest kid at heart and I've never met a more active father than him. Yuka, you are so beyond loved and I'm so grateful that our children get to grow up with a father such as you and I'm so incredibly honored to be your wife. Thank you for this amazing life and you should be celebrated all the time, baby boo. <laughs> I love you so much, Yugi. Happy birthday to Yugi. Too so much rock for one hand, baby. <laughs> I'm a huge struggle bus right now, but I love my husband. Happy birthday. This happened a, a few weeks ago. Guys, I know I've been gone. Um, just a brief little life update. The girls are now in kindergarten. Amelie is currently completing her kindergarten training, which means like, I, you know, I'm going with her little by little. Um, but I think by the end of this week, she will be going on her own. I'm a big girl. <laughs> so um, I'm so beyond grateful for you guys' patience and I cannot wait to create a bunch of content with the time that I'm going to be given in the next week or so. So yeah, we're back in action, baby. Let's get it. Love you guys so much. Hope you enjoyed this video and until next time, Bye! <laughs>